a couple of weeks ago, th this would have been filled with people. It's been seen in 176 different countries and raised eyebrows from England to Everest, but now ratings for the YouTube sensation known as Tweaker Cam have dropped off considerably. We have a million and a half upset people. They want us to find entertainment for them, and we're just tickled to death that it's very boring. Fed up with a homeless camp that's plagued his neighborhood for years, Gary Watts recently set up HD video cameras outside his Everett business. They captured grim images of people shooting up in broad daylight. Today, that very same street corner, dubbed Tweakerville, is a ghost town. Can you imagine Christmas coming and then all at once, in a matter of two or three days, you see the place clean up almost totally? Since the cameras went up, police arrested 16 people between here and a nearby park. The dealers seem to have disappeared, but where did the dozens of others go? We're not sure, but we're hoping they went to one of these fine cities around us that will give them a, a, a safe place to make their injections, that will give them better services locally, that will provide them better food, that will provide them better health care. They are not going down to Seattle because you can inject. Sylvia Anderson runs the Ever Gospel Mission. She says they've all moved down by the river where they're out of sight and out of mind for many, but she says this will not solve the problem. The truth is, unless you keep up this intensity, the people will gradually come back. So what is the long term solution that meets the need of the business community and uh, ministries such as ours and the people on the street? Sure enough, a small handful of homeless are creeping back close to the corner, but Gary plans to keep the intensity high and the cameras rolling. Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.